It made contact. NASA Insider just leaked James Webb Telescope Terrifying Discovery in space. When you want to observe somewhere so far into space that you will never be able to reach it, you send a space observation station. NASA has done just that by launching the James Webb Space Telescope, also called JWST, into deep space, allowing us to see more of our universe. The human spirit knows no bounds. We thought we'd seen the end of physics, but now we know the wonder of discovery will continue long after we're gone. Welcome to our channel, where we provide you with facts related to space. Before heading on to the video, make sure to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and hit the bell icon so you may never miss any of our updates. One of the places the JWST was pointed at is the very edge of the universe. The discoveries at the edge of the universe promise to be frightening. Have you ever wanted to finish a task, but wish you had the right tools? You should geek out on yours. Scientists worldwide were working on a smartphone, but lacked the precision tools to crack them open, or desperately needed a flamethrower. The universe contains many mysteries that scientists attempt to unravel from their current position until the James Webb Telescope launch. One of the most perplexing is the question of how the universe began. There are numerous pieces of research concerning this, but they must still be proven, and the proof is centered on finding out exactly what happened at the universe's beginning. That is no easy task, because it necessitates the best equipment humankind has ever created. The tool must be able to see the edge of the universe to study it. Some of the oldest objects or formations have existed for billions of years, and it's time to debunk them. This is where the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, comes in. The JWST is simply the most powerful telescope humans have ever dreamed of. Galileo Galilei must be proud of how far his craft has progressed, but progress comes at the cost of $10 billion and many anxious moments. Since everything went well with the launch and installation of the JWST in its permanent orbit, NASA can now sit back and enjoy the massive scientific returns from the space observatory that the JWST has been delivering in such a short time that the scientists have been working on it. The JWST has revealed shocking things about our universe, many of which scientists did not see coming at all. It is not an exaggeration to say that the JWST is already taking us far back into the past and closer to the edge of the universe. Scientists call this period a glimpse of the early universe. This is due to its ability to detect the faint light of extremely distant galaxies as they glow in infrared light, a wavelength that is invisible to human eyes. As such, the image we are discussing here has been helping astronomers to understand better how galaxies form and evolved in the universe's early days. The image that has excited scientists captured a galaxy cluster, Max 0647, and the distant galaxy Max 0647 JD. The cluster appears as a dazzling collection of galaxies that shine like precious gems against the dark backdrop of space, allowing distant galaxies to be seen because of a specific type of observational phenomenon caused by the cluster. This phenomenon is known as gravitational lensing, and it occurs when galaxies in the foreground act as magnifying glasses, allowing us to see more distant objects behind them. Small boxes were used to pinpoint the Galaxy Max 0647JD, and more detailed images of the galaxy are aligned along the right side of the image. The cluster, essentially triple, lends the galaxy magnifying it and causing it to appear in three separate places within the image. Each box on the right depicts a different aspect of the galaxy. 
While Max 0647 JD was discovered using the Hubble Space Telescope 10 years ago, it did not take long for the JWST to reveal something surprising about the cluster. Here's what happened when the Hubble was used. It was only pale red. We could tell it was a tiny galaxy in the first 400 million years of the universe because it was so small. Scientists were able to resolve two objects using the powerful JWST, but a mystery remains. Are these two galaxies, or two clumps of stars within a galaxy? They don't know yet, but guess what they're counting on to find out? The JWST. These are not even the most distant objects discovered by the JWST. That honor goes to one of the first galaxies to form shortly after the Big Bang. This specific galaxy was captured only 350 million years after the Big Bang, or the universe's beginning. Glass Planet and another galaxy formed about 450 million years after the Big Bang was discovered. Soon after, the powerful Space Observatory began infrared observations of the universe. Previously, the earliest observed galaxy was GNs 11, which existed 400 million years after the Big Bang and was discovered by the Hubble Space Telescope in 2016. The scientists using the JWST stated that as soon as they began collecting data, they realized that there were many more distant galaxies than they had anticipated. Essentially, the universe produced galaxies faster and earlier than previously thought. Hundreds of millions of years after the Big Bang, there were already many galaxies, and the JWST has just opened up a new frontier, providing us with a front row seat to understand how it all began. Both discovered galaxies have spheres or disk-like shapes, but they are only a tiny percentage of the size of the Milky Way galaxy. The two galaxies are very far away from us, but they are extremely bright and produce stars at a rapid rate. Further research has suggested that galaxies may have begun to appear in the universe just 100 million years after the Big Bang, 13.8 billion years ago. This timeline calls into question astronomers' theories about how and when the first galaxies formed. The early universe was undeniably chaotic and crowded, which was perplexing. However, the structure of the two galaxies' taxons proved to be calm and orderly. Do you know what else has perplexed these scientists? It is the sheer brightness of these two galaxies. We need a powerful near-mid-infrared telescope to see the first stars and galaxies, which is exactly what the web is. Another distant object clarified by the JWST is what is commonly known as the Pillars of Creation. Hubble first captured this in 1995. While it was impressive then, the JWST has far surpassed it now. The three-dimensional pillars are permeable and resemble rock formations. The columns are made up of cooler interstellar gas and dust appearing semi-transparent in near-infrared light. Thank you for the images. Quite stunning, too. A supernova known as DS-16C2NM was discovered in 2016, and scientists confirmed that such a supernova is extremely rare. It's the most extreme version of what you'd call a normal supernova. A team of international astronomers made the discovery, and they believe the explosion occurred around 10.5 billion years ago. This occurrence means that the light from the explosion has been traveling to us for more than three quarters of the universe's existence. What's more mind-boggling is that the supernova's location is even more astounding, thanks to the universe's expansion. The team also enlisted the assistance of two powerful telescopes, the Magellan Telescope and the Keck Observatory. It took five years and 525 nights of observation involving over 400 scientists from all over the world. While the scientists encountered many difficulties locating the supernova, the effort 
will pay off in various ways. The extreme distance of DS-16C2NM provides the scientific community with a new understanding of the nature of superluminous supernovas, SLSN. By studying the ultraviolet light emitted by the SLSN, scientists can calculate the number of metals produced in the explosion. It can also provide information about the temperature at which the explosion occurs. These two elements are critical to understanding what causes and drives these gigantic cosmic explosions. However, it may not be long before another more distant supernova is discovered, as scientists are looking for them due to the remarkable discovery of DS-16C2NM. Sometimes the universe surprises us with unexpected gifts, such as a bed in one. The universe is vast, but it has so many objects that it can't help but stack them on top of one another. Nebulae, star clusters, and galaxies can be all found one after another. This was precisely the case when the Hubble Space Telescope was used to photograph NGC 6752, a globular star cluster. This cluster is 13,000 light years away from us in the Milky Way galaxy. Scientists were both surprised and excited to discover a previously unknown galaxy hidden behind a cluster of stars. A spheroidal dwarf star is about 30 million light years away, which means it is about 2,300 times farther away than the cluster in front of it. All thanks to the JWST. What do you think about these crazy discoveries so far? If you have reached this far, like this video, subscribe to our channel, and press the notification bell so you may not miss any future updates. See you in another video. Until then, take care. Tell us your views in the comment section.